Hey, what's going on? Todd Falcone here. Welcome to ToddFalcone.com. And I want to talk a little bit about leadership today for a second. So uh, given what I do for a living, speaking, teaching, training, and being in all these different companies, countries, cultures, uh, I get a chance to observe and like, it's a pretty cool position to be in because I literally get to see how people operate and function in, in different companies, in different countries, in different continents. And it's just, it's a trip. And sometimes it's really cool to see, wow, this is really awesome. They got it together and sometimes they don't. And yeah, and, and so <laughs> I just had a little uh, thought for a second about something I witnessed the other day that was kind of interesting. So, but here, here's what I want to talk about today. I want to talk about what, what I believe is true leadership when it comes to events specifically. So when I know, here's how I know a, a, a company or a culture is doing really well is when I show up and I'm in the room, wherever I'm at, whether I'm on stage or not, and I'm, well, here's what I'm witnessing. I'm seeing all of the top leaders in the company, and they're in the front row, or they're in the front couple rows. Journals open, taking notes, totally focused on the event and what's happening. That, to me, is a culture to be duplicated. That, to me, is true leadership. And people who understand leadership in network marketing because they realize that people do what people see. And, you know, they're not sitting there with their laptops open, text messaging while the person's on stage, talking to one another, they're focused. Because they understand in this scenario that all eyes are on them and that people do exactly what it is that they see the leaders doing. So if you want to duplicate people who are focused, paying attention, present, taking notes, learning, being in that experience, then that's how you are. And that to me is when I walk into a culture or a company where they got it going on, they, they, they get it. Versus, and this is going to piss off a couple people, I'm sorry, but it's going to. There's a situation where people, where I walk into rooms and I'm doing, and I got some bug flying around, I'm not going to recut it, but leave me alone, man. Get out of here. So... When I walk into a room and the top leader's in the back and they're roaming around in the hallway, the meeting's going on and the top leadership is, is out in the hallway roaming around like, this. It's, oh, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm so good. <laughs> that they don't have to listen to what's going on. Because here's the thing, and this is the thing that they don't understand is we're watching you. We're looking at, oh my God, he's in the hallway. So maybe I should be in the hallway because that's what the leaders are doing. They're in the hallway. They're not listening. They're not paying attention. You know, see, that's the thing. The w distributors in the field, they're not, we're watching you. We're looking at it. And, and, and so I might even get up and go, I might, in fact, I'm so distracted by the fact that I keep seeing you in the back of the room that I can't even focus on what's going on in the front of the room. I'm telling you, I see this all the time. Heads being turned. They can hear the conversation going on in the back. I mean, that's horrific. So I'm doing this video just to give maybe some awareness for people that, you know, are either in leadership positions, moving into leadership positions, uh, brand new distributors, whatever, that... The kind of culture you do want to create is, especially at events, like people, you're getting people to an event for a reason. There's some activity, something going on on stage. <sighs> Come on now, get away from me. And the idea here is to have people focus on what's going on, not uh, I'm so good that I can stand in the back of the room because that's when you're creating a disaster for uh, your organization is when you start uh, thinking you're so good that you don't even have to be in the room anymore. So. But it's so cool when I walk into a room and I see all the top leaders, they're all in the front of the room, journals are open, taking notes as if it's the first time, even though who knows, it's probably the 150,000th time they've seen that same training. That to me is a culture worth striving for. So I appreciate you guys for watching. We'll see you on another video. Todd Falcone here at ToddFalcone.com. If you're on my YouTube channel, head over to ToddFalcone.com. That's where the conversation's at. We'll see you on another video.